The collision repair industry is rapidly changing before our very eyes. Should we expect even more change in the future? We're gonna find out next. With all of the new technologies featuring artificial intelligence affecting nearly every aspect of our lives, we would be foolish to think that major advances in the collision repair industry would not affect us and even more foolish to not prepare for them. So let's gaze into the crystal ball and see what's in store for us in the next 10 years or so. Most of us have been aware of the GM OnStar system over the past 25 years and how it, when activated, can interact verbally with the occupants of equipped GM vehicles, offering a host of services at various package levels. It also offers services such as turn-by-turn -turn directions to destinations and helps in the event of a crash, breakdown, or emergency, and in tracking and locating and recovery of lost or stolen vehicles equipped with the system. It was recently announced that GM is now offering OnStar insurance at select locations and will be rolling it out across the nation in the coming year. The insurance is being made available for all makes. However, certain discounts are available if the vehicle has an activated onboard OnStar safety and security system. It is anticipated that in the future, other systems and insurance products like OnStar will be sold at the point of sale at authorized new and used car dealerships. Let's say an OnStar equipped vehicle goes off the road and strikes a tree. OnStar member services immediately begin speaking with the driver saying, I see you've had a collision event in your vehicle and it has been rendered inoperable. Are you alone or do you have passengers? Are other vehicles involved? Is anyone injured and in need of immediate medical attention? In the not too distant future, it is anticipated that most, if not all automakers will offer similar OBCS services and their own insurance products, whether it's their own or in other companies. Artificial intelligence will play a significant role in the future, and auto insurance, sold at the point of sale, will have a dramatic effect on those repairers who are not always certified. It is likely that this will become standard for all manufacturers in their efforts to offer the best and most advanced services and thus gain market share. Participation in such programs may become required for consumers as part of owning the vehicle and or the insurance policy contract. Some will offer discounts as an incentive, which most vehicle owners will gladly accept. This will allow the OEM to have greater control over the repair process to ensure a proper repair is performed and function, performance, appearance, and confidence is retained, thus ensuring that the vehicle owner will keep purchasing vehicles from them. As you can see, similar to DRP relationships, post-sale OEM involvement may be much more effective at channeling or steering potential customers to the authorized dealer or independent, non-affiliated repairs who have achieved manufacturer certifications. Of course, the selected repairer will likely concede to mandated discounts and concessions to acquire and retain such direct referrals. Electric vehicles are here to stay, and their numbers will continue to increase in the near future. The U.S. government expects all auto manufacturers to offer EVs to the general marketplace by 2025. In 10 years, government fuel standards are set to double from their current level, which means that automobiles will have to average 54.5 miles per gallon. This is going to force vehicles to become smaller and lighter with more energy efficient engines. Electric vehicles will become more common and new manufacturers will pop up to meet the demand, including Rivian, Lucid, Fisker, and others. Ask yourself if your shop is prepared to take on the repair of an EV. Do you possess the necessary accommodations to even recharge an electric vehicle? Is your shop equipped and trained to handle the repair of an EV and take the necessary safety procedures and precautions called for with high voltage? The automotive industry is set for a tidal wave of change in technology, marketing, and more. And it is not in some far distant future. It's now. To succeed in this new world of mobility and smart technologies, repairs will have to adapt and change at unprecedented speed. Existing businesses will require new cultures, equipment, and practices. Companies will have to think like a startup, tap into new talent, and engage the digital consumer. Those who can adapt and overcome will prevail and be able to take full advantage of commercial opportunities, profitability, and success. I'm Jason Stahl. 
Thanks for watching.